Hi everyone, it's Amik and Aika from GospelThroughArts.com. It's a beautiful Tuesday. I'm excited to speak about the Word of God with you today. I am here in the Union Station waiting for my, my colleague to come. We are, um, our department is uh, volunteering in a food bank today. Uh, so I am downtown today waiting um, the right time. I'm a little early. I have to wait till the right time. Uh, for everyone to meet here and for us to go to Etobicoke in a food bank to volunteer today. It's going to be a nice uh, time because I don't want to do my audit job. I prefer to do volunteering today. <laughs> but after work we have to um, do our balance of balance day would be working. Um, but I want to encourage you and tell you, my brother and sister, our Lord Jesus sees you, knows you, and knows whatever you need. He is our good, good shepherd. He's our good, good father. He's everything that you need. If you need a friend, he is your friend today. If you need a companion, he is your companion. He says to you that he'll never leave you nor forsake you. He's with you throughout your life in every stage of your life when you are a young person when you are an old person whatever stage of your life our Lord Jesus promises that he'll never leave you nor forsake you he will be with you he will guide you he would be your faithful faithful friend today I'm near the Via Trail um, train station and I can see different times there is a train that's going to Niagara Falls, a train that goes to Montreal, one train that is going to Ottawa, one train that's going to Windsor. They're all uh, far away destinations. And uh, one day, uh, and it gives you the, the, the gate number and all the information, the time of departure. It's pretty expensive to travel in VR Trail, um, VR Rail, uh, but um, Go Train will be a really good, uh, reasonable uh, method of um, travel to Niagara Falls. That will be a destination I would love to go in the train one day. Um, but uh, my brothers and sisters, I want to encourage you and say that God is with you wherever you go. Maybe you're going to work today. Maybe you're going to do some errands maybe you're going to a hospital for your appointment whatever place that you are going remind yourself that god of the ages the god of heaven the god who created you is going walking with you going to go before you level the ways for you make a way where there seems to be no way have you come to situations in your life where there seems to be no way that is when God steps in. In my life, I've had many, many occasions where it looks impossible. It looks something that I cannot control. But when I call on to Him, when I cry to Him, when I speak about Him, He comes for my rescue. He will be my strength. He will be my, my direction, directing every step. So let's pray today. Let's spend a little more time praying today and committing and asking God to make a way in whatever situations you are in. Maybe you need a financial breakthrough. Maybe you need a health issue sorted out. Maybe you need God to move in your life. Whatever it is, let's start praying. Father God, we come to you today in the name of Jesus, the name that is above every other name. Lord, we thank you that at the name of Jesus, every knee will bow, every tongue will confess that you are Lord. Thank you, Father, that you are our shepherd. Thank you, Father, that you are our God. You are the creator of the universe. There's nothing that you cannot do. You created the heavens and the earth. You created the stars, the sun and the moon. Lord Jesus, you have created everything. So humbly we come to you, Lord. Create a miracle in our life, Lord. Make a way where there seems to be no way. Lord, I pray for the people who need a touch from you, a healing touch, Lord. Maybe, Lord, I pray that whatever the situations they are in, that you would be their doctor, that you will be their physician, that you will be their surgeon, that you will be, Lord Jesus, 
whatever that they need lord the help the shoes we bring to you lord may by your stripes that you um, were beaten at the cross lord and by the blood that was shed for us lord may it clean them may it cleanse them may it heal them lord jesus heal our bodies lord all our aches and pains you know and you see lord i pray that you would touch and heal your children heal your people lord i pray for people who need a breakthrough with their finances lord you own a cattle on a thousand hills lord you own everything lord you own the money lord in the banks lord you own the houses you own the lands you own everything lord so lord i pray that you would start something new in their lives lord jesus a breakthrough financially lord i pray that you create revenues for them lord create ways create ideas lord create ways lord prosper them in their workplaces favor them with their managers co-workers and everyone around lord Lord, I pr uh, pray for my work situation. Give me wisdom and knowledge and favor all the hurdles that I have to jump in. Lord, I pray that you give me strength and favor. Lord, we also pray, Father, Lord, for anyone who needs, um, Lord Jesus, love and peace and joy in their homes, in their situations, in their uh, relationships, Lord, that you give them forgiveness to love one another, Lord Jesus, that you give them peace that passes all understanding. I pray that you give them joy that they need, Lord Jesus, whatever situation they are in, Lord, provide for them, protect them, guide them and guard them, Lord cover them under the blood of jesus lord cover us lord today under the blood of jesus from all harm and danger from all the darts of the enemy protect us from temptation lord i pray that you guide us lord guide us lord our spirits are with you lord holy spirit reign in us holy spirit use us whatever we say today whatever we speak today whatever we do today may it bring you glory may it bring jesus glory in everything we do so lord i pray that you go before us be our doctor be our physician be our provider be our helper lord today may you be the king of our lives may you be the sovereign god in over our lives today we pray for our families, we pray for our children, we pray for our spouses, we pray for our in-laws, we pray for our relations, we pray for every friend, we pray for our church family, we pray for our pastors, we pray for our missionaries, we pray for everyone in persecuted churches, we pray for Canada and USA and all the countries in the world. Lord, I pray that you give peace, that peace that comes only from you, that you will come and reign and that your will be done and your kingdom come lord maranatha come lord jesus come and take us soon lord help us to endure while we wait for your coming your second coming we wait anticipating lord jesus we wait expectantly lord while we wait lord we are careful to give you glory give you honor give you praise everything we do so lord be glorified today in our life use us lord guide us lord wisdom and knowledge may follow us all the days of our life may your words be in our hearts may your thoughts be in our minds may you protect our mind and our thoughts and our hearts today in the mighty name of jesus we pray amen my brother and sister it's it's a blessing to pray with you and talk with you every day i love when i can do my devotional because i know that even one person listens to it this they would be blessed because when we pray together if one or two gather in the name of jesus and pray for one another god is in the midst of us god will hear us god will get all the glory all the honor all the praise it's still 7 30 i have lots of time waiting here so my brother and sister let's sing a worship song what can i say uh, the thought was in my heart that to sing psalm 23 and it says the lord is my shepherd let's see if i remember all the words the lord's my shepherd i'll not want he makes me lie in pastures green he leads me by the still, still waters. 
His goodness restores my soul And I will trust in you alone Yes, I will trust in you alone For your goodness and your mercy Will guide me forevermore Yet though I walk the darkest night I will not fear the evil one For you are with me and your rod and staff They comfort me where I go I will trust in you alone Yes, I will trust in you alone For your endless mercies follows me your goodness will lead me on my brother and sister that is all i remember by heart let me show you the go train station it's so huge and it's so beautiful and let me show you around while i have lots of time that's so beautiful paintings too let me show you um the structure of these buildings are so huge and so beautiful. This is the Front Street entrance where first, when I first came to Canada and I was looking for jobs and I registered in an agency where they would find jobs and it was called Manpower. And when I registered in that agency, I was able to get my first job in the bank and that was 61 Front Street in the bank so um, that was I'll show you the building this was the building that I was first working and it's called 61 front street now that I have lots of time um, my friend will be joining me here but I'm supposed to meet her a little bit later so let me walk around and show you the place where I, where I first started working when I first um, came to Canada and God has been so faithful and I'm working in this company in this bank for 18 years God has been faithful first I joined as a, um, from the agency so I had to pay 40% of my salary to the agency and I only got to take 60% home and still God was faithful God provided and uh, now now i and then after two years they made me permanent then i don't have to work through the agency anymore and i was able to get the the full pay um, i'm just going to show you the exact building of that the sun is shining on me can you see the cn tower too that is the cn tower let me quickly show you the inside so that was the building that I used to work when I first joined it was called the 61 front street it's on just near the Union Station and it's opposite to all these buildings beautiful buildings and there was they had a Royal Bank opposite and the beautiful hotels as well my brother and sister God is with you I'm just showing you all this to tell you that God has been with me and my life is not perfect as you know I go through ups and downs but through it all he's been faithful he's been good he's been my strong tower my refuge my help in time of need so I would be saying bye to you now and i will download this video and then i'll wait for my friend to come so we can go to etobicoke to do our volunteering today have yourself a wonderful tuesday may god bless you may god be with you may god guide you and guard you everything you do today have yourself a wonderful day god bless you bye